a man to pay for my maintenance. Ain't no telling when I'm fucking when I just soon. That's what they be yelling. I'm a pit by blood, not relation. Y'all be chasing, I'll be placed dumb, huh? Drunk on Chris, money on E. Can't keep a little model hands on me. Both in the club, high singing on P. And I win. Good morning, lovers. Um, welcome back to another vlog. It's your girl Buddha, aka Yes Pretty B. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new here. And if you're not new here, thank you so much for um, joining me back for this video. So I'm covering up my ass because my lashes is bald. Okay, bald baby. Okay, my eyelid is called, and they want their lashes back. Y'all, I've been wearing lashes for years, okay, years, and I just, I mean, I don't care what kind of lashes I put on, they gonna just be damaged. But it's okay, because I got some maintenance coming up for y'all in this vlog. I do all of my own maintenance. As you can see, my nails is effed up, but that's okay, because these is a month old, so I'm finna to do my nails, do my lashes. I'm not going to do nothing special to my hair because I've been trying to keep heat off of it for a little bit because I got a lot of heat damage. I just, I just look like a naked mole rat, if you ask me. Me without lashes? And they gone. They just gone, y'all. <laughs> Ain't no telling when I'm fucking when I just soon. That's what they be yelling. I'm a pit by blood, not relation. Y'all be chasing, I'll be placed dumb, huh? Drunk on Chris, money on E. Can't keep a little model hands on me. Both in the club, high singing on P. And I win. Okay, y'all, so I'm back home. I did get my eyebrows done. I don't really like them. Usually, I like them the next day, but. <sighs> It's not giving. So I don't think I'm going to like them at all. I let a new lady do them today, but that's what I get for rushing. That's what I get for rushing. But it's fine. I be usually filling them in anyway when I do my makeup, so it's not a big deal. So I'm back at the house. Um, I'm about to get ready to get started on my lashes. So usually what I do when I have time, I just sit and I make all the fans um, at once. So I use these lashes from Amazon, and it's called Va Va Lash. And so I like to get the uh, 0 0.03 CC curl 15 millimeters. So it look like this. And then um, I link them like I link my Amazon storefront um, in the description. It should be like under like beauty or something like that. Ain't no telling when I fuck them, well, I just soon. That's what they be yelling. I'm a pit by blood, not relation. Y'all be chasing, I'll be placed dumb, huh? Drunk on Chris, money on E. Can't keep a little model hands on me. Both in the club, high singing on P. And I it gets better, ordered another round It's about to go down Got six model chicks, six bottles of crisps Four velvet ass, got weed everywhere What do you say, me, you and your Chloe glasses uh -huh. Go somewhere private where we can discuss fashion Like Prada blouse, Gucci bra, okay Cause you can never kill my vibe But there is no sacrifice Everything was taken You had to make it Vibe killer Me and the take shit Vibe So lashes are done. I think I did a pretty good job. I'm rushing. I hate that I had to rush through these. Um, but I have to film a video, promo video for B3000. If y'all don't know what B3000 is, that's the love robot that I play. Um, so I have to film a promo. So I'm trying to hurry up and get done. Uh, but I ended up rushing through this other eye. So they look a little bit um, different from each other. But... It's okay. I do plan on starting back getting my lashes done. Um, 
because y'all it's just too stressful i like being able to have the freedom to be able to do it myself but it's just too stressful but i am satisfied with them so it's fine for now but i will go back to my going and pay for my lashes to get done because and stuff like this that i'd be like oh my god i'm rushing i got you know and i could have just got them done and just you know had it over with but anyway y'all so i'm gonna open up i have to get ready i'm gonna like just fix my baby hair a little bit and maybe like put like some little curls in my hair um real quick before i gotta go and film i got a new like needle nose flat iron from amazon so I just figured I could open these up with y'all real quick because it's going to be my first time using them. I hope that they were good. I don't know if they were good or not, but we're going to see. I'm going to heat them up and we're going to try to get these baby hairs together. Um, I got that and I got a new hot comb because y'all, I got 4C here. And when I tell you that, this this might be D. A, B, C, D. <laughs> this might be D, F in the back, baby. This, this kitchen back here, the kitchen, no matter what I do, it's never just going to be straight or late. It, I, it ain't never going to be like that. But the hot comb definitely helped out with that and keep it straight, you know, at least for like that day or maybe two days. After that, it's back curled, very tight, napped, okay? Like, we want to be nice and sweet, but it's napped, okay? And that's okay. I can say that because it's my naps. But um, I'm definitely 4C, if not more. Just the rest of my hair, of course, is heat trained. But that that back, that ain't never getting heat trained. So I got a, <laughs> I got a hot comb. Um, this one is just either. I think it's just two temps. Uh, I got this off Amazon. We're going to see how we like this one, too. I'm going to link all of this down. I'm going to link my storefront down below so we can... Um, so what is that? I'm going to link my Amazon storefront down below so y'all can purchase if y'all want. But we're going to see how this works. We're going to see right now. Um, so this one goes from, I think it gives you either, okay, ceramic. Oh, I got a little, um, a little stand on there. I don't know if y'all can see that. I've been needing this because I be trying to fan stuff so I won't burn my countertops. Um, I be trying to fan stuff to put down on here. So this is perfect. So it goes either from 450 to 430. Um, we can do 430. I'll see how 430 is. So I'm gonna do that. And let's go to the bathroom. Oh, I forgot about this. Also, I got a little strainer for when I like make pasta and stuff like that. And you can add, you can attach the strainer. Oh, it falls up. It's a silicone strainer that you can attach to your pots. Um Ooh. Oh, that's really cool. So you attach it to the pot. Let's get a pot. So I got a pretty large pot right here. Let's see how this works. Real quick. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> that is so cool. Look at that. And then you just psh, pour it, pour it, and it holds all of your food here. And it just, oh, I like this. Okay, so this I got off Amazon. This is a good, good bath. Because I love pasta. Like, I probably eat too much pasta. But we ain't going to go there. Anyway, this is about maintenance. So let's see how these products work. Let's put it to the test. Okay, so we in the bathroom and y'all, <laughs> this um, flat iron heated up just like that. I love that. And the hot comb, hot too. But I don't know how quickly it heated up, but I don't know. I'll, girl, I'll be scared to touch it, but it's it's there. It's hot. I put it on 430 on that one in the needle nose um, flat iron. I put it on 410. So it's like really skinny. I love this. Ooh, yes. I'm excited. And y'all, I love that this flat iron got the little kickstand to it. I never had, I mean, not the flat iron, the, um, what that is? Hot comb. I love that the hot comb got a little kickstand to it. I never had one that had that. And y'all, it's so convenient because I be always trying to figure out ways to not burn my counter. So I'm just, 
getting this kitchen a little bit calmed out and then I'm gonna go ahead and put the hot comb to it Can't forget behind the ear because that kink up real bad too. Y'all, I'm telling y'all, it's stressful doing your own maintenance, but baby, I don't have a man to pay for my maintenance. And a big part of it is too, I don't have time to go. Like whenever I want to make an appointment to get something done. I, it's like everybody booked, everybody booked. Everybody that's good is booked. So it's like, huh, with me working, doing content, being a single mom, like, y'all, I don't be having time to get out and get my hair and stuff done, my lashes, but I'm gonna have to start figuring out a way to fit it in, just get ahead of it and like be strategic so I can get into these places. But unfortunately, y'all, I don't get me a man to pay for my maintenance um so you know me i like to save some money so i ain't mad at it i think i'm gonna skip well um, i might as well just see what's to it let me see this little kickstand get hot too so be careful Hey, this this hot comb is hot combing though. I ain't gonna hold you. Look at that. This still sticking up. Let me let me cut, not cut. Let me part. Let me part this. Okay, so I'm just finished this up real quick. Then we are gonna move on to the pencil nose, needle nose, whatever you wanna call it, flat iron. We are gonna see what's to that. Cause it how these how these how this hot comb coming. These flat irons better be. I'm going to just put like some little curls in here real quick and then we're going to go ahead and move on to trying to see how the other flat irons work with baby hairs. Uh oh, I think I messed this curl up already. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. Okay, so we got the curls in. Of course, I'm going to just leave them like this for now. And then, oop, I missed the spot. Then I'm gonna um, fluff them out a little bit. So it's nice and hot. It's been ready. It heated up real fast too. It probably was like, it probably heated up in like 30 seconds. Ooh, okay. So far, I'm loving it. Okay, let's see. Because I f usually flip this one up and then I uh, curl this one down. Like a downward curl. So, let's see. Okay. We looking good so far. All right, then I need my got to be glue spray. And I just spray it on my comb and then lay them down. Um, okay, so far so good. So yes, y'all, I cannot complain about any of these products from Amazon. I'm definitely recommending them. So like I said before, I'm going to have my Amazon storefront link in the description box below. Click them if y'all want these. I have no complaints. They did me good. All right. Okay. I think we're good. Now I got some body to my hair. It's not looking too flat and crazy and flimsy. And we good. We loving it. We loving it. We loving it. We gonna do the nails. 
what's up lovers so today is nail day so my maintenance has been going over the course of like two days because i still have to work and be a mom and everything so today i have the time to sit down and do my nails and when i tell you they need it they need it so bad we're just gonna get right into it i'm gonna show y'all my setup real quick um I do have a nail desk, but in my old house, I had like an extra room, so I had a beauty room. But now my nail desk is like in a back storage area, so it's just not convenient or smart for me to be back there because it's not well ventilated. And with the fumes and stuff, I don't want to take that chance. So I use these little tables right here just for my supplies um, and also a little the same little table in front of me so I can put my hands on those. okay so here you see me getting ready to do my pedicure i don't have a pedicure tub i will be getting one but you know i'm not a stranger to making it work um i like to use the dr bronner's soap it's nice and cleansing and it helps me when i'm exfoliating um, I did have some body scrubs, but I took the time to read the ingredients this time and y'all it had like the red 40 dye The yellow dye and all of that. So I said, you know what? I'm throwing these away. I will not be using these um, But yeah, so I just made sure I exfoliated really well So I wouldn't have to worry about not having a body scrub and this part was probably the most relaxing actually um it just feels really good to put my feet in warm water and to be able to just cleanse and get rid of all the excess dead skin and everything this is a very important part of my maintenance routine here you see me just starting the process of the pedicure, removing all the dead skin off my toes so I can have a nice, fresh, clean, professional look. I lost the clip of me adding the acrylic, so I basically just did a fill-in on my toes. Um, I don't know how that clip got deleted, but it's nowhere to be found. But you just see me here doing a French tip with a white gel polish, and I'm gonna go ahead and cure that. So I was super ashy here. Of course, I didn't wanna take the chance of putting on oils or anything prior to me actually putting the acrylic down. I didn't wanna interrupt the acrylic process. 
Um, so I'm desperately oiling my legs and feet. <laughs> You can never kill my life But there is no sacrifice Everything was taken You had to make it Five pillar Me and look at take shit Five pillar You big kill The money kill My eyes are set Follow the stars Yeah, you shall find the It's a bad fight If you hit your enemies Enemies shine so nails are done okay y'all see me being dramatic holding the starbucks cup just so y'all can see my nails period nails done feet done but yeah y'all i just do all of my own maintenance because it saves me some money it is actually fun and relaxing too i enjoy being able to have the freedom to be able to do it myself and like anybody can do it like i just went on youtube and learned how to do it so anybody can do it why well, still got my seatbelt on because i'm parked um about to enjoy my starbucks it's a nice day it's a nice breeze so i just wanted to park and just enjoy my little time and wind down this is another way i wind down and this is part of maintenance too like making sure y'all get some relaxation in make sure you do something that you enjoy but yeah y'all y'all can handle y'all own maintenance unfortunately i don't have a man to pay for my maintenance but that's not gonna stop me from getting cute and it's also not gonna stop me from saving some money either <laughs> okay uh, yes like buying all of the products is not cheap i use valentino products um uh, mainly and it's not cheap but it's an investment because of course you can do all of the stuff on your own but you want high quality or high-end brands um so that you can get that salon look you know you know so of course i want to have like i want to still look expensive of course i still want to look like you know i spent some money okay so i have it's a must that i have to use good products um but if y'all want to know like more in depth of what i use and why i use them and how like my journey of learning how to do my own maintenance comment down below and let me know what y'all want to know girls but yeah i'm just fit to enjoy my matcha i think i'm gonna end this maintenance vlog right here if you haven't already please like comment and subscribe definitely don't forget to subscribe and hit the post notification bell so you can see every time i make a post and i thank y'all for tuning in i love you lovers and thank you for loving me